the 10 rudest countries to be aware of while traveling. Today, we're diving into a topic that's both intriguing and, well, a tad controversial. We're exploring the top 10 countries that have gained a reputation for being, shall we say, a little less than welcoming to tourists. But hey, don't let that discredit you. Because behind the sometimes prickly facade lies a world of fascinating stories and places that you won't want to miss. I stumbled upon a blog that spilled the beans on a guy's not-so-sunny experiences in Germany, where he claimed the term rude was an understatement. And he wasn't stopping there, other countries got dragged into the mix too. But hey, curiosity peak, right? So, I decided to take matters into my own hands. I tapped into the pulse of some communities online by digging into various polls. The results? Well, let's just say they're about to paint a vivid picture of travel tales you won't want to miss. So, fasten your seatbelts and get ready to explore. Let's jump right in. Number 1. France, amidst Paris's elegance. The spotlight is on the Parisian attitude. It's more than whispers, it's locals wearing directness as a badge. Hold on to your berets, because behind this candidness lies a city unafraid to reveal its layers. Stroll along the Seine's cobblestones, savoring the famed romance. Parisians' candidness isn't plain rudeness, it's valuing authenticity. In a whirlwind world, isn't this unfiltered approach refreshing? Rude might phrase eyebrows, but don't get tangled in translations. The Louvre, a treasure trove of art, invites you to decipher stories firsthand. Pastries? Oh la la! Cafes offer culinary masterpieces, whispering tales of patisserie prowess. Embrace the Parisian flair, for within candid cityscape lies an awful blend of authenticity and allure that captivates hearts worldwide. Paris, a canvas painted with candor, reveals a nuanced tapestry where candid conversations and hidden pastries create a symphony that resonates with those who seek unvarnished experiences. So, fellow adventurers, while directness might initially surprise, remember that within this lively dialogue lies a Paris that invites you to explore its mosaic of passions, sights, and flavors. Number 2. Russia. Buckle up, intrepid travelers, because our next stop sweeps us into the enigmatic heart of Russia. Picture this, stern faces, minimal smiles, and a vibe that could give James Bond a run for his rubles. But here's the scoop, Russia's unwavering stoicism isn't just for show. It's a testament to a history that echoes through time, from the regal halls of St. Petersburg's opulent palaces to the pulse of Moscow's iconic Red Square. While friendly might not be their middle name, there's a reason behind the poker faces. The chilling winters and complex history have etched a unique demeanor into the fabric of Russian society. But don't be quick to write them off, fellow wanderers. Behind that seemingly icy exterior, there's an unbreakable spirit, a warmth that defies the cold and an artistic legacy that has gifted the world with masterpieces beyond compare. So, as we navigate through this intriguing land, let's remember that beyond the stone walls and fur hats lies a journey that's as riveting as any spy thriller. Number 3. China Buckle up for a journey east to China, where ancient traditions merge with bustling cities. Life's tempo might catch you off guard as locals embrace a no-nonsense approach that's raised a few eyebrows. Amid the Great Wall's grandeur and the forbidden city's mystique, a world of wonder beckons. Venture into the enigmatic realm of China, where traditions and modernity entwine into a mesmerizing symphony. Here, in a land where dragons roam and life moves at a whirlwind pace, the no-nonsense attitude is as solid as the Great Wall itself. Now, about that reputation, China's directness might seem brusque but delve deeper. Beyond the surface lies a world of captivating contrasts. While bustling markets thrive, serene temples offer respite a blend that defines this nation. Navigating cityscapes and immersing in ancient customs, remember that China's stories lie around every corner. It's a dance where East meets West and authenticity meets rapid progress, creating an allure that's as complex as captivating. Number 4. Germany O oh, Deutschland, a country that prides itself on efficiency and precision. A nation that knows a thing or two about getting things done, and trust me, they don't beat around the bush. Now, I've got to be honest, Germany isn't necessarily on everyone's list for warm and fuzzy interactions. With a culture that values punctuality to the point of reverence, you might get a directness that could catch you off guard. Waiting in line? Expect the perfect cue etiquette. Opinions? They're handed out like precision-engineered clockwork. But wait, before you write them off, take a step back. 
Beyond the candid conversations and zero tolerance for tardiness lies a land of history, enchantment, and yes, even charm. So, fellow adventurers, as you navigate this realm of efficiency and precision, don't let the directness overshadow the enchantment of Germany's castles that could have inspired fairy tales and villages that exude old world charm. The truth is, much like anywhere else, not everyone's cut from the same cloth, and amid the precision beats the heart of a country that's ready to welcome you with all its fascinating layers. Number 5. South Korea, a nation where politeness isn't just a formality. It's woven into the very fabric of society. But hey, let's be real, this place isn't everyone's cup of kimchi. With a cultural backdrop as intricate as Seoul's neon-lit streets, South Korea boasts a blend of modern marvels and ancient traditions. Now, before you get caught up in the politeness, here's the twist. The subtleties of Korean interactions might leave you scratching your head. But trust me, beneath the calm demeanor lies a cultural dance that's been perfected over centuries. It's not about being rude, it's about observing the harmony of respect and hierarchy. So, as you navigate through this land of K-pop sensations and tranquil temples, remember that what might seem reserved is actually a nation that thrives on art, innovation, and a deep-rooted appreciation for history. Behind those polite bows and no-nonsense conversations, there's a South Korea that's ready to reveal its stories one polite gesture at a time. Number 6. The United Kingdom where royalty and rain clouds seem to coexist, presenting a charming paradox. Now, hold on to your deep cups, because we're diving into a land where dry humor reigns supreme, and politeness might just be a fancy coat that disguises what some call rudeness. Picture this, bustling streets of London, the glorious countryside, and castles that have seen centuries come and go. But there's more to the story than just picturesque landscapes. Within the British banter and reserved conversations lies a nation that values tradition, wit, and yes, a certain distance. With around 40 million visitors flocking to the UK each year, there's no doubt that the allure of Shakespearean theaters and sprawling gardens holds a global magnetism. But here's the kicker, about 26% of those polled viewed the UK as one of the top three rudest countries. So, fellow wanderers, let's embrace the blend of sarcasm and serenity that makes up the British experience. Whether it's a cheeky retort or a well-timed eye roll, remember, amidst the politeness, you'll find stories that echo through history's corridors and a cultural tapestry that's as fascinating as it is, well, British. Number 7. The Czech Republic, where medieval charm meets modern intricacies. Brace yourselves for a land of fairy tale castles and cobblestone streets that might toss a quirky curveball your way. The Czechs embrace a direct approach. Let's unravel the mystery. Imagine strolling Prague's enchanting lanes where history seeps from every stone. That candid attitude might not fit traditional politeness, yet it's a reflection of a nation unafraid to speak their minds. Around 22 million visitors grace its borders yearly. The Czech Republic's allure isn't a secret. Here's the twist, to around 30% soy among the rudest countries. It's not about being unfriendly, but straightforward conversations that might catch you off guard. Fellow adventurers, uncover bohemian gems and soak in stories that echo through centuries. Behind candid conversations lies a cultural landscape waiting to be explored one candid statement at a time. Number 8. Italy, where the aroma of pasta fills the air, and history whispers through every cobblestone street. Hold on to your pizza slices because we're venturing into a land of mouth-watering cuisine and passionate expressions. Now, here's the twist. That reputation for rudeness is more of a cultural dance than a snub. Imagine the Colosseum standing proud and looming in the heart of Rome. Gelato, that's an invitation to indulge in the charm of Venice's waterways. While some might perceive Italian directness as rudeness, it's a reflection of a nation that values authenticity. With over 90 million visitors flooding its iconic cities, Italy's allure remains as undeniable as its pasta carbonara. While Italy's warmth can rival the Mediterranean sun, some might find the candidness a tad overwhelming. But wait, here's the kicker. Around 41% of those surveyed considered Italians one of the top three rudest nations. It's not about the gesticulating hands or candid conversations, it's about Italians being unapologetically themselves. Number 9. Switzerland the land of precision, chocolate, and some might say, a certain air of aloofness. As you breathe in the crisp alpine air, let's unravel the story beneath the polished exterior. Known for its punctuality and meticulousness, Switzerland's reserved nature might raise an eyebrow. 
Visualize the grandeur of the Matterhorn and the tranquility of Lake Geneva, but there is more than meets the eye. Behind those impeccable watch faces lies a country that values privacy and efficiency. With over 10 million tourists basking in its alpine charm, Switzerland's allure isn't a secret. And now for the twist, a select 35% of those surveyed dubbed Switzerland one of the top three rudest countries. But hold on, it's not rudeness, it's a slice of the Swiss way of life, a reflection of their intricate values. Number 10, the United States, a land of diversity that's as vast as its landscapes. From the bustling streets of New York to the sun-soaked beaches of California, the U.S. offers a mosaic of experiences. Now, hold on to your cowboy hats because this nation's approach might not be everyone's cup of iced tea. Picture the iconic skyline of Manhattan and the majesty of the Grand Canyon. But here's the catch. The U.S.'s cultural norms might come off as varied, even puzzling. With over 70 million visitors exploring its offerings yearly, the U.S.'s allure is undeniable. Now, for the surprise, around 15% of those polled viewed the U.S. as one of the top three rudest countries. But hang on, it's not about being outright rude, it's a result of the diverse cultural norms that shape interactions in this expansive nation. So there you have it, our list of the top 10 rudest countries that are anything but boring. Remember, every culture has its unique way of interacting, and what might seem impolite to one person can be perfectly normal to another. As you explore these intriguing destinations, embrace the differences, and you'll unlock the captivating stories and hidden gems that await. Thanks for joining us on this eye-opening journey, and make sure to subscribe to this channel and watch the next video on our channel.